Hello again, it's Vicki with Condi Systems Technical Support and I'm in Photoshop CS6 with PC for personal computer, not a Mac. And I'm going to show you how to configure the ICC profile uh, using the uh, Condi settings with um, using ICC profile set up for CS6, Photoshop CS6. This is the new version of Photoshop and it's going to be the uh, latest greatest version and uh, we're going to walk you through configuring the settings for ICC profile. So having the application open, uh, just simply go into your start menu and clicking on uh, your CS6 version should open up a page that looks very similar to this. If I click file and then new, that gives me a dialog box so I can select my uh, document size and information that I want to uh, add or use my document with. So we're going to call this demo. Uh, custom setting, I'll probably use photo. That gives my gives me enough resolution on my document that uh, I can work with. Transparency is what I will select. It's what I usually select. Some people choose white. All this looks, uh, this sRGB profile is what we want to use. We do want an RGB environment for our ICC profiles in the way we set up our settings here at Condi. This is your paper size. Doesn't matter right now because all we're going to do is configure a. Uh, um, we're just going to configure a uh, ICC profile setup and demonstrate how to do that so that when you do have an image to put in here, you um, you're all ready to go. You just click and go. So I'm just going to go ahead and click OK. I have my document the way I want it, and. Uh, now I just need to put something on this page and the reason I want to add something here is so that I can open up my print settings and do my configurations for ICC. I'm going to choose a tool over here where I can just draw. I just want to draw something on this page so that it, uh, there's something there uh, that I can get to my print menu. And I'm going to choose this little square and I got some crosshairs. I'm going to left click and hold it down and that draws a square. Now I can go to my print menu. So I'm going to go to file. I'm going to choose print. And that opens up a dialog box where I can choose my printer and select my settings. So this is my print preview. This is what my page looks like. I'm going to come over here to my printer and I'm going to choose my GX. Uh, E7700. Now this would work with a 33, a 3110, and a 5050 or a 7000. So keep in mind you can do this with any um, of the Ricoh uh, drivers. Also your Epson's. Um, you can also choose an Epson driver and do the same setup, exactly the same, just using a different printer, different profile. Keep in mind our profiles are unique to the printer. So if you have a, a 7700 printer then you're going to have a um, Ditrans high quality 7700 ICC profile. So choose your printer, um, jump down to color management. If you don't see it, there's your little arrow. You're going to drop it down. You're going to go to color handling. You're going to let Photoshop manages color. Once we have that we can, this won't be grayed out where it says printer profile. Drop that down find the profile for your 7700 or your 33 or your 3110 whichever printer you have you would have been sent a profile from Condi uh, by email the only way to get it is to send an email to Condi support at Condi.com so support at Condi.com and we will forward back your profile uh, based on your uh, purchases here at Condi and printer profile is added rendering intent will be perceptual if you don't see that click your drop down left click on perceptual by default this is checked everything that you see here nothing else changes uh, within the color management setting but what we need to do now if you are a person who has a Rico we have to reverse the image if you have an Epson you can reverse the image from the driver settings but this is a Rico so we need to find where to reverse it inside the application. Okay, so CS6 is a little different from the earlier versions. You're going to drop down, um, you're going to come down to functions. If you don't see functions dropped in your drop down list, make sure that, uh, you know, 
you can move these things about so that they expand out and you can find your emulsion down here under functions. Emulsion down is the same thing as mirror or flip the image horizontally. Same exact thing. If you check that box then you have uh, defaulted it to mirror every time. And you have some additional settings in here which I don't do anything with but the emulsion down is something you're going to need for Rico users and uh, setting up your dye sublimation system to print in reverse in a reverse style. So again, just to go over it quickly, printer, choose your printer. Color handling is Photoshop manages color. Your color profile will correspond with your printer based on the profile that's sent to you by the Condi support staff. Perceptual is your rendering intent. And then under functions is emul emulsion down. Now if you're using glass, of course, you won't reverse the image. But most everything you're going to use uh, where you flip the image over, you have to reverse. So to save that, just click Done. And that'll save it. Close out the box. And when you go back in there, your settings, just to show you, will be as they were when we left them. So again, that's how you set up the new Photoshop CS6 version. If you have any questions, feel free to give us a call at Condi. 1-800-826-6332 and go to 2 for your first available support staff member. Anyone here is happy to help you with your configuration settings for ICC profile. And again, my name is Vicki and as always, thank you for your time.